So let me now work on this. So for these, I'm gonna be displaying the, the second one. I'm gonna be I'm gonna display it uh, in the center of the screen, uh, in the center of the uh, of the element. So it's gonna be centered vertically as well as horizontally. Whereas the last one, I'm gonna center this uh, vertically, but I'm gonna display it on the right side. So to do this, I'm gonna copy this uh, code and I'm gonna paste it two times. So the second time, the first time, the first time one nth child one. The second time nth child two. Because we want the second time, we want to access the details of the second child. So the second the details, this is the first child, this is the first uh, one, this is the second one, and this is the third one. So if I say the nth, the second nth child, I'm accessing this details. So for this details, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to say here align items center. And the text align is also going to be centered, center. For the the one in uh, in child uh, three, this is going to be three. I'm going to say align items flex end, and the text align is going to be end or or left or or left. You can say uh, or right. You can say right. Let me show you now what's going to happen if I refresh. As you can see, if I refresh, this is going to be uh, centered vertically and horizontally. And this is going to be centered vertically, but it's going to be displayed on the left side. And this is going to be centered vertically, but horizontally it's going to be displayed on the right side. And whenever you hover over these, um, the, uh, whenever you hover over the buttons, the button will turn to an orange color. Also, I'm going to add a um, hover uh, effect to the, to the card itself. To, to the object itself. So to do this, remember we have the details, we have this details. We can say here, we can say new and then dot one and then details and then I'm gonna say hover. Hover. So upon hovering, what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna change the background color. I'm gonna say background and then I'm going to change change the background color to let's say uh, let's select a color. Let me here say corn silk. Let's try this one. So if I refresh, as you can see, if you hover, this is going to look like this is how it's going to look like. Uh, and I think it looks amazing. I think I think the color um, is great. This color is, is just great. Uh, or you can even select another color because this is very bright. We need a color that uh, works well with with this uh, with the text color. So you can, for example, use the uh, dark gold uh, iron rod. I think this one would look amazing. I think this one is better. I think this one is better. So you can use this or the 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 other one. So I'm gonna go back to the to the old one, to the one that I chose first, which is the corn silk. I think the corn silk looks amazing. Now let me refresh, and I think the corn silk looks amazing.